Friends, you ladies, my name is Jackson Guy, and welcome back to Kindergarten. This should be the final mission that we have to do. We're moving on to Lily's mission. Uh, well, we have another thing to do after that, which is get all these cards. What is this big gap? Has that always been there? That big gap in the ground? No, it hasn't. When did that show up? I have no idea. Anyway, we're moving on. This looks like a freaking Tamagotchi. I don't want to pick up that, even though I think I have to. So, somebody else gave a nice comment on what to do for this mission, so... Throw it up on screen from Judy K. Says, to do Lily's mission, you have to bring the key the note Nugget gave you and the phone. Okay. So I have to bring all three of these things in here. Uh, talk to Lily about the note. Give the note to Monty. Talk to Lily. Get sent to the principal's office and look under the rug and tell Lily what you saw under the rug. Talk to Monty at lunch and get the note back. Then go to Lily. Then go with Lily to the principal's office in the back of the desk for the key. Go under the rug and I don't want to spoil. Okay, 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 okay. Close that off. Close that off. I'm not going to look at the rest of that anymore. Um, well, I have to, but I'm not reading the last part of it because I don't want to be spoiled. Um, Bring the key, even though they said they weren't going to spoil it, and I'm sure they didn't, but I still don't want to read the rest of the sentence just in case. So I have to bring this. Bring the key. Wait, this doesn't start me automatically, does it? Do I need money? Well, I have 95 cents, so... I don't know. Okay, I'm going to school. I think I might need money. So, I'm just going to go ahead at first. Anyway, Lillers! What's up? Oh, um, hey, I'm Lily. You've probably heard about what happened to my brother Billy. I have. I come to you from the future. Which is weird. I'm like a time-traveling child because every day is the same thing for all these other kids. It's like Groundhog Day, except I retain the knowledge that I have. What is that? It looks like Billy's handwriting. Where did you get this? How, what do you know? Nugget gave it to me. I knew Nugget was holding out on me. Do you, do you know what it says? I can't read as well as my brother could. No. I'm, th I'm four years old, Lily. What do you need from me? I'm, th I'm three. Well, then you have to find someone who can. Hurry. Oh, Monto, my brodo. He can definitely read. Sure, I'll read it for you. But it's going to cost you a book. Well, nut sacks. So I have to grind through the day to get some money, so Nugget, my old buddy, old pal. I only have friendship to give you, Nugget. Nugget, you know. Nugget knows what's going on. Okay, so I got to do this and start the day over so I can actually get some money to be able to afford any of the stuff for this Monday again. Times 15. I really love Monday. Actually, now leave the thing here. I'm going to bring three dollars. Because three dollars is the max I can bring without bugs messing me up. Because if I bring more than that, he's going to take half. So it's the maximum amount I can have without him dicking me over. And then maybe if I need to buy more stuff, I might not even need three bucks, but just in case. Oh, I haven't checked my hints either. Uh, not Monty's mission, Lily's. You need to have special items for Monty, Nugget, and Bugs in order to complete Lily's mission. Okay, I know that now. You need to buy cigarettes in the schoolyard. Okay, that's a good hint. That's something I can actually use. Bring the notes. Bring the key. And bring this. Cool! It's time to start my day! Do, 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 do. I love the music in this game. This game has a bit of a... an escapist's vibe about it as well, I think. Like figuring out how to survive stuff and how to get through the day. I like it. It's gonna cost you a buck, okay. Okay. Let's see here. Jeez, this hands writing is atrocious. It says something about a hatch in the principal's office that can be opened with the code written below. What's the code? That's where the handwriting gets especially terrible. This is gonna take me a while to decipher. I'll try to have it figured out for you by lunch. Okay. Uh, talk to Lily, give the no, no, thing to Monty, and then talk to Lily again. Got it. Well, wh what did it say? Something about opening a secret hatch in the principal's office. A secret hatch? That's probably where he's keeping Billy. We have to get in there. We have to save him. Only... What? I need a way to get in there without the principal knowing. I've got a plan, but it requires getting a phone and a key into the principal's office. I have a phone! It only took me 14 Mondays to get it. 
No way! That's so great! Now what I need is a key to the office! I, ha I have that as well! Don't ask how- don't! You don't want to know, Lily! Wow! You have everything I need! This is so great! I can tell you my plan now! What is it? I need you to actually get sent to the office, alone! And once inside, you have to find that hatch! I know how to get there! If I bug Nugget about Billy, he'll send me there, won't he? Nugget has to be on, on this somehow! I'm sure he can help you get there, whether he knows it or not. Just pressure him and I'm sure something will happen. Good luck! Thanks! Oh, and one more thing! If he gives you a strange device, do not come talk to me until you get rid of it. Why? It's a listening device! I love how her mouth is just going, blah, 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 blah. The principal gives them to anyone he finds suspicious. He had me carry one for weeks before he gave up. I'm pretty sure Nugget has one now, so be careful. Alright! So what does this hint say? Um, Nugget will send you to the office alone if you don't stop talking about Billy. Yeah. What do you know, Nugget? Hi, my friends. What happened to Billy? Billy is missing. Poor Nugget misses Billy. But Nugget can't help. Do you know where he is? Who knows? Okay, we've heard all this stuff before. We were not. The principal has forbidden me from speaking. Okay, here we go. Oh, my, 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 my! The principal just called me! He wants to see you in his office now! What did you and this little weirdo do? Well, get going then. The principal is an impatient man. He once shot four kids just because I told him to go to his office. So I've been told that you're feeling sad about Billy. I guess I have. What do I answer? Oh. I guess I have. That's all this is about, right? Billy's missing and it's making you sad. You're not trying to find him or anything. You're just sad he's gone. Right. Whew. Okay. That makes this a whole lot easier. See, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to give you something, and I want you to take it whenever you're feeling sad about Billy. It's just a little something I ordered for this exact reason. Here, take one whenever you miss Billy too much, okay? You giving me pills? Don't just tell anyone you got them from me. The whole monitor is waiting to take you back to class. Please head outside. Can I just take a sneak peek? This rug seems a little out of place. Whoa there! No need to go snooping around my office! Get out of here! I see it! I see it! It's a secret hatch! That's the one John Locke saw! Welcome back! I hope everything turned out okay with the principal! Everything's fine, teacher. Go back to drinking whiskey. Say! The principal didn't happen to give you anything, did he? Oh... Should I give the pills? I don't know if I need the pills. Oh no! You give me some pills. Oh lucky day! You wouldn't mind if your lovely teacher had one now, would you? Be my guest. Good boy! I forgot to buy cigarettes! Fook of my life! Can I restart this room? Or can I buy cigarettes? No, it said I need to buy cigarettes off Monty in the schoolyard. I don't think I can actually buy them here. Shite. Right, we're back in the game. Now I have cigarettes, and I just got back from the principal, so who do I need to talk to? Send the principal's office, talk to... Okay. Did you, did you see the hatch? Do you know where Billy is? I saw the hatch. Excellent. Now we move on to the next phase. Destroy the principal! We need to get a, a way to get into the principal's office, but he's not in there. How do we do that? We need a way to get him out, and a way to get us in. I think I can lure him out if I can call him. Okay. Monty said he'll have to code for the hatch at lunch, right? Come see me then. There's one more thing, though. If this all goes horribly wrong, I don't know you. <laughs> We're going to need a probable cause for doing what we did. We need some actual evidence. Where do we get that? Well, if there's a mess in this school, who cleans it up? Janitor. Dr. Janitor. I'm guessing the janitor has something to do with all of this. See if he's doing anything suspicious. Gizzity got it. New hint unlocked. You can get evidence by convincing the janitor to go clean the toilet. Okay. Do I do that at lunch then? But how do I get out at lunch? You wanna be my morning buddy? I don't want anything. 
Do I go there now? Because there are ways of getting out of this and going to the bathroom now, right? Oh, I don't know. I'm heading out. I'm heading out. Well, I have a pass. Oh, wait, I can't go any further? What the fuck? Don't I need evidence? Oh. Tell him to go clean the toilets. Okay, how do I- how do I get this? How do I- Cause I'm gonna fuck it up, I know it. Uh This person didn't say anything about it though. Okay. You're kidding, right? Oh! These bags! Haha! <laughs> Nothing for you to worry your stupid little head about. Now run along! It's bleeding. Stop worrying about my stupid little head. How do I convince him to go clean the toilets? don't know. Let's go check stuff. It's a sink. Walk away from sink. Perfect! Ew! Who's sicked up in this? Gross. Okay, someone on the other side. The door won't budge. Someone must be in there. Try another saw. Okay, can I convince you to clean the toilet? Should I have checked the toilet first? Ah, shit. I'm gonna try this again, but I'm gonna go straight to the bathrooms. Instead of going to him, I'm gonna check on all these toilets, and then maybe I can, like, trigger him to clean it, because I started this conversation without having anything else. Gross! I don't wanna use that. Hello, Mr. Janitor. The toilet over there needs cleaning, yes. Yeah, I know. Who do you think messed it up in the first place? Well, are you gonna clean it? Not if I don't have to. I get paid by the hour, not by the toilet. Just use another saw. All the other ones are taken. Ah, fine, I'll take care of it. Thanks! Stupid kid. Making me clean this stupid toilet with my stupid mop. Because it's my stupid job. Okay, can I look in these? This is an extremely bloody and gross bag. The parts in it are too big to carry except for a severed finger. Should I take it? Okay, there's a monster mon car. Should I take it? No. There's a bloody shoe in this box. Should I take it? Oh god, which which one's Billy's? The finger or the shoe? Yes. Uh-oh. Did I do it? Yeah! There! Crapper's clean! Now that you'll get a chance to use it, the bell just rang. Get out of here! Not that you'll get a chance to use it. I don't know, I'm fucking high on my own mop smell. What's up, Miss Jiggle Tits? Right in time for lunch. All right. So this is Billy's shoe. I found the shoe in a bag. That's Billy's shoe. It's exactly what we need. Okay, we go forward with the plan. So what now? It's time to find out what happened to my brother. Did you get the code from Monty? Not yet. Go get it then. Come see me when you have it. All righters. I figured you'd be seeing. I'd be. I figured you'd be seeing me around now. Slop is no good, and I don't think anyone is brave enough to try it. Whatever, yeah. Did you cipher the note? Psh! Of course I did! I wrote it on the back of the note. Here you go. Have fun with that. Thanks, homie! Out we go. I got it. I already paid off the lunch lady. We need to head to the bathroom. From there, we use the phone to call the principal's office and lure him to the classroom. I'll meet you there. To the bathroom we go. That's why I needed ciggies. My little cigarettes. This is the most stuff I've ever had in my inventory. I think it might be. <laughs> Cause now we have to pay off this guy with the cigarettes. No, you don't understand. This is so important. You can't stop us. There must be something we can do. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I can let you guys off the hook if you gave me a pack of cigarettes. I just ran out. Here! Oh wow, thanks little bro. Yeah, go do whatever. Times are changing, I guess. What are you insinuating? Good thinking bringing those cigarettes. Now give me the phone. I have a very important call to make to the principal. Um, hello, Mr. Principal? Lily? Is that you? How are you calling me with your teacher's phone? Put her on! No, but if you want to save her life, you better get over to the classroom now. What's the meaning of this? Lily, answer me, young lady. Click. That should do it. Yup. I can hear him heading down the hall, let's go! 
Fuck yes! What are we gonna find? Super curious. This is George, the principal's office. Unlock that shit. I can't believe it! We're in! Where's that hatch? Under the rug in the corner! Is Billy actually gonna be alive down here? What the? There's no place to enter the code! This lock takes a key! What are we gonna do? What? Is there somewhere else to enter a code? What about over here? In the bin! There's some papers and a Monstermon card in here. I don't fucking care about Monstermon cards right now. There's a hatch on the floor. Dry blood stain surrounding the carpet. It is locked. Walk away. What? There must be somewhere to enter a code. Aha! There's a lock in the desk drawer. It looks like it takes a code of some sort. Oh, yes. There's a fancy key inside. Let's take this key. That's a badass looking key. It's like a Kingdom Hearts keyblade. Key has to be hidden around somewhere. I found it! Well, what are you waiting for? Put the key in the lock. There's a hatch on the floor. Open the hatch. Okay, that did it. Hey, um, before we go down there, I just want to say thanks. I wouldn't have gotten this far without you. No prob, Bob. Whatever happens out there, stay close. We can do this. Oh, Jesus! Is that Mew and Cthulhu? <laughs> wow. I can't believe this is under the- Billy! What? What has he done to you? Well, that's Billy. You look a little like Mew, dude. We have to find a way to release him. Hurry! The music's awesome. Also, my throat is getting dry. There was nothing in that. <laughs> I don't know why I, I even attempted it. Okay, what do we do? What is this? This looks like the slop from the cafeteria. Looks like we figured out what the secret ingredient is. Gross! Ew! Is this Nugget's hole? <laughs> Who are these? And there's just a random chair here. What the fuck is he doing with people in tanks? Enter a command. Oh, shit. Oh, no. What do I do? Press the yellow button? But these cost moves. This is the uh, this is on yellow. Active tank change to one. There we go. Active tank change to two. So now do I? I want to enter this one. Oh God! I killed him. Neutralizing contents of tank two. No! Stop! What have you done? You- you killed him! I failed him! Billy died! Don't blend Billy! <laughs> My bad! <laughs> okay, let's do this part again. I think... Can I just... Uh, red is to blend them. So let's- let's- let's do yellow again. Yellow again, and then let's press... Press. Let's press green. Reverting mutation process on contents of tank 2. Billy! You're alive! Screw you, Billy! Sorry, I had to. It worked! You fixed him! Now just find a way to get him out of there. Enter a command. Blue button? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! This is bad! Uh-oh! Is it gonna kill me? Yeah! <laughs> You died! Kill the creature near you before you hit the blue button. Okay, what about this one? So I have to hit yellow, red, yellow, green, blue. I think. Do I have enough apples for all of this? Okay, press the yellow button. And then press the red button to blend, motherfucker. Then press the yellow button again. Green. Yeah, come on back, Pilatron! Why is he mutating people? Ah, the lights went out! I can't see a thing! Oh, nutsack! <laughs> Get away from my experiments! I knew it! I knew you were behind all of this! You've had my brother the whole time! <laughs> that voice dries out your throat. 
Yes, Lily! You have been a very particular thorn in my side. I knew I shouldn't have chosen him. Chosen him for what? What's the meaning of all of this? I suppose you should know what this is all about before I execute you. I, I would like to know. These creatures live deep beneath the school. They give off certain chemicals that affect the human body in interesting ways. Like how? I've been putting it in pills. It has a different effect on each person who tries it. Miss Abigail seems to have developed a dependence on it. What about Nugget? It, uh, fixes him. I don't know what's wrong with him to begin with, but they seem to make him better. What about Billy? The creatures in these things, besides him, are quite hostile. I was looking to replicate the chemical production in humans to reduce the risk factors. That doesn't explain Billy. Nugget was going to use to go to be my original test subject, but Billy stumbled upon one of the creatures, bodies in the janitor's closet while he was dealing with a dog or something. Oh no, Cindy's dog! Okay, so that's it. That's everything you need to know. I have to kill you now, unfortunately. Can't have this getting out. Press the blue button and it goes to kill him. Releasing context of all viable tanks. No! What have you done? Stay away from me! What about us, though? It's gonna kill us afterwards. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, no! He's all fucked up! Are you just gonna jump in the hole? Bye! <laughs> Billy, wake up! Come on! Huh? Where, where am I? What's going on, Lily? He's alive! <coughs> <coughs> he saved! We did it! <laughs> can can we get out of here? I wanna go home. <laughs> After all the trauma and heartache and horror that's going on, it's just like, I'm tired. Laugh track. Of course we can, silly. I mean, Billy. But first we have to go to show and tell. Let's get out of here. Look what I brought to show and tell. It's my brother who was dead. Well, look who's back from skipping recess. Nugget's friend has returned. Billy is free from the evil principle. Shut it, weirdo. I hope you all have a good excuse. I'm sorry, Miss Applegate, but we found Billy. I was in a vat under the school. I see. But that's no excuse for leaving a supervised area. Go to the principal's office. Um, principal kind of exploded. So there's no one around to sign my checks? I don't think so. Okay, then. Bye. <laughs> Great fucking teacher. I guess we can leave too, then. Yay, Billy's back. We saved him. Ah, oh, a little extra student for the day. Billy, you're looking a little rough. I think you need a shower. I don't know if I'll ever be able to come up with the words to thank you for what you did today. Yeah, you saved my life. There's nothing I can do that would be fitting. Well, maybe there's one thing. You're right. So here it is. This is an ultra rare monster mon card. Our dad works at the company that makes them. This is the only one in existence. What is it? You can also have this collector's guide. It tells you where you can find Monster Mon cards. Thanks for everything you've done today. We should get home. I'm sure our parents are wondering where I am right about now. Yeah, this is all just happening on a Monday. Even though for me, it's gone on for weeks. Bye. We did it! Blue Eyes Gold Dragon. <laughs> Man, I remember when I collected Yu-Gi-Oh cards and I went off, like when they first came out, and it was super, they were like really expensive when they first came out and to get decks I got three of Kaiba's decks So I had three blue eyes white dragons at the start I saved up all my money and bought them Because I wanted the three blue eyes white dragons like he had And then I battled my friends and kicked the shit out of them <laughs> So I, I, I had better cards, what can I say? Please don't sue <laughs> Nice, okay! We did it! We saved Billy! Even though I don't know why Jack, of all people, is saving Billy, but I'm gonna sit, stand in this little black square. It's perfect little size for my little bouncing boy! So, that's the main story element of the game done. You found out what happened to Billy, even though 
the reasoning behind it was a little lackluster, that you found creatures under the ground, and they secreted a chemical that you could turn into pills that had different effects on people, most of which it was just making them docile, and not really anything else. So you tried to make them, you tried to turn him into one of them, just so you could get the chemical out of Billy, to be able to sell the pills and maybe make money, or maybe just hide things. It's a little weird. <laughs> I'm into it though. I'm glad we actually got to the end of it and we actually found Billy and we got it all sorted out. So next time, I have to go find all the Monstermon cards. Oh, Jesus. Bugs will give you Cactus Outlaw if you give him cigarettes. Ooh. Freeze Guy Jim is in one of the cubbies. Martian Orb Man is hidden in Bugs' secret stash. You can access it by stabbing Bugs and following him out to the hallway. What the fuck? Nuga will give you King Tower Beetle if you bring him a magnifying glass during morning time. Bugs will give you Shroom Turtle if you give him either a flask or breathalyzer at recess. Cindy will give you Giraffe Serpent if you give her a pill while playing house. Literally grass, got that one. Cindy will give you Oh Fuck a Tornado <laughs> if you find out what happened to her dog instead of getting something gross in the closet. The teacher will give you Really Bright Star if you dump the blood on Cindy instead of Lily at recess. Cindy will give you Doom Jelly if you put gum in Lily's hair and get back to her during lunch. I feel like I should have gotten that. Unscrew the air vent in the hall, okay. I knew that one. Wizard Worm is in the Nugget Cave next to the skulls. The Ugglebop Bop Golem is hidden underneath Nugget's lunch table. Eye of the Buttholder <laughs> is in one of the boxes in the bathroom. Eye of the Buttholder is in one of the- oh, I just went over the same one. The janitor will give you Man with Long Arm if you show him Jerome's Hall Pass. Why? The janitor will give you Evil Thwarter if you get Cindy to eat one of his biscuit balls. The principal will give you Spiky Flim Flam if you tell him you were fighting with Billy over Monstermon cards. The lunch lady will give you Uneaten Cake if she thinks you went through three helpings of slop. You can buy Holy Night from Monty during recess for twelve fifty. Fapton Kalkin <laughs> is in your silly meal from special lunch with the teacher. Wall of Castle can be found in the trash can in the principal's office. Magical airship is inside the silly meal Monty sells you at lunch. Show it at show and tell to get it. You get blue eyes gold dragon after completing Lily's mission. After collecting all 25 cards, you will unlock a special item coming in full release. Is this full release? Bringing this item to Nugget Cave can cause some things to happen coming in full release. Oh, I'm excited. God, that is a lot of shit to get done because that's- I can't do all of them in one day. I'm gonna have to go through it multiple times on multiple days to get all of them, so... I might do some of them off camera and just grind through them, like the ones where I just have to go out, get a screwdriver, unscrew the vent and get the monster mon card, but the ones where I have to like stab bugs... I'd probably record those ones just so we can see what happens because that sounds hilarious, but for now... Thank you guys so much for watching this episode! If you liked it, PUNCH THE LIKE BUTTON IN THE FACE! LIKE A BUS! And high fives all around. Whoosh, whoosh. Thank you guys, and I will see you all you dudes. Man, I got a new keyboard today, a smaller one, and it's being christened in a shower of saliva. <laughs>